YouTube friends. Happy Valentine's Day. It's a little on the 13th, but I have planned to have this posted at exactly midnight to uh, be one of the first, hopefully, to wish you and your lady love or man love or whoever you love uh, a very happy and wonderful Valentine's Day. I am wearing, this is not so vintage, this was a gift given to me in 2014 or 15 by a dear friend, and I love it. Now, I broke all the buttons. I'm not that great with buttons, so I wear it with this cameo pin that I love, which gives it a beautiful look, I think. And I want to say also, I got these, this beautiful flower arrangement. It came with several red roses. They're, I'll show you. They're in here now. They came a couple of days ago from David Bowie in uh, Pennsylvania. Very wonderful, beautiful human being that I love like so many of you. And my special hello is tonight is very special, although they always are. Oh no! They always are, but tonight I have a couple people that I said hello to in the past and a special reason. In fact, I dedicated to playing this album in particular to a very, very special friend. I'll get to that in a moment when I bring you closer for a heart to heart for Valentine's Day. <laughs> Hello again, dear YouTube friends. I am back for the heart to heart. Okay. I think I'll start today's video with these special hellos. I already mentioned David Bowie and the most beautiful flower arrangement he sent, and I love it. And it inspired my nails. I've got red on the toes, by the way. The heels again. I've got red on the toes and purple on the fingers. And uh, I'm not doing the um, acrylic fill anymore at the salon. I, I've... Uh, decided to go back to completely natural nails, which means that sometimes they're not always the same length. I don't care. And I, I, and his flower arrangement he sent me with a lovely uh, kind of fuchsia and purple and red inspired my red toes and purple fingers, so that's nice. All right, so Alvin Chester. This evening I chose a Kenny Loggins album that I love so much. I love Kenny Loggins. I always loved Loggins and Messina. And I love Kenny Loggins. I didn't care for Footloose that much, but I love that song from Caddyshack, I'm Alright. And, and anyway, I just love Kenny Loggins, most of his stuff. So this is an older album called Celebrate Me Home. And I chose it for Alvin Cheshire who sent me beautiful pictures of his very charming home. He has a fireplace in his bedroom. Alvin, don't hate me for telling people, but that is, God, that is wonderful. I would love, oh God, and on Valentine's Day, I would love to have the windows open on a snowy, cold night, or even no snow, just a cold night in the winter, but snow would make it more romantic with a fire roaring under the covers. Oh my goodness. That would just be beautiful. I love your home, and I, sh I thank you, my friend, for sending me those pictures. And Alvin was in a, uh, a store that had a whole bunch of retro uh, records, vintage, to be precise, records and thought of me. And, and it made me feel so good, Alvin. I love you for that message. I loved you before, but I really like that. Okay, so also, Alp Tagu. Hi, Alp. Uh, Dissin Dojo Martial Arts and Self Defense. He left a great message on one of my videos, and I went to your channel, Dissin Martial, Dissin Dojo Martial Arts and Self Defense, and I subscribed, and I plan to watch it. And uh, well, I'll tell you what, my YouTube friends, if you're in any, if you're at all interested in learning anything about it, I would suggest you look at his channel. It looks very very interesting and uh yeah i'm excited thank you for that distant dojo martial arts and self-defense i don't know if you expected me to subscribe to your channel but i did louis muniz not my first not my last hello to you sweetheart sunny side up in the morning a lovely and sunny 
sunshiny lady. Hi, sweetie. And uh, Precious Faith. God, I love that name. I just love it. And I love what you work too, Precious. I think you're adorable. <laughs> and I love that name, Precious Faith. Beautiful, beautiful, just beautiful. So those are today's special hellos. Now I wanted to have a heart to heart with you, my dear YouTube friends. But at this very moment, all of a sudden, many of the thoughts I had for today's video just went out the window. So I'm going to go off the cuff tell you what's on my mind right now. Number one, it is Valentine's Day. And I know a lot of people feel Valentine's Day is extremely commercialized, and it is. But it's also a wonderful excuse to celebrate love and romance. So whoever you're sharing it with, and if you're not sharing it with anyone, I'll tell you something. I gave my mother a valentine today, and I told her she is my valentine today. Because, well, tomorrow, but I gave it to her today. Because see, right now, it's uh, it's like 10, a little after. Actually, oh no, it's not even 10. But by the time I get this video up, I'm, I'm, I'm planning to post it at midnight. So we're just going to say Valentine's Day. I bought my mother a beautiful Valentine's Day card that said for mom on Valentine's Day. And uh, I wrote it and I said, you're my Valentine. <laughs> she loved it. So if you don't have a partner or a wife or a husband, or I guess there's a partner, whatever, maybe you give it to someone you love who would least expect it. I know it made my mom's day. She had deer in her eye. It was really beautiful. And now I'm thrilled that she was my Valentine. But... If you, are, if you are fortunate enough to really, truly be in love, enjoy today with your love, with your special love. Uh, I hope you do. I really do because uh, it's so beautiful when you're truly in love. And only fans, friends, we've got a very special video tonight. I'm going to tell you some real truths. Yes, I am. Really honest truths about, I'll, I'll touch upon it here, why not, when your partner, I'll just stick with partner because it sort of applies to everybody and everything that when you're in love, or even think you are, when you do something for the one you love, who are you really doing it for? Are you doing it for you or for them? This is my measuring stick for love, real love, true love, love that, in my opinion, lasts eternity. So, romance love, not parents and that kind of thing. I'm talking romance. So, the question should be, when I do something for my partner, who am I really, who gets the joy of it most? Is it them? Am I doing it for them? Or is it for me? Because I enjoy making them happy. And I really believe that is the true, true measuring stick. Because when someone does something for someone else, and I'm not talking about charitable and acts of kindness, that's all different. I'm going into intimate, romantic time with somebody you love, even little things. It's, it's different when you're in love and you know, if you're watching my channel, you understand that. And if, and if you've had enough life experience to understand that, well, hold the thought. <laughs> I guarantee you will one day. <laughs> and hopefully you'll be with that person or at least have experienced it. Um, yeah. So, enough of that stuff for now because I'm sure you, uh, you probably maybe already know it, but it's nice to be reminded. And like I said, only fans, friends, we've got a very sexy spin on that topic tonight. <laughs> I'm going to share some secrets with you. Yes, I am. I do a lot anyways, but these are real intimate, very, very serious secrets that I'm going to put a goofy, sexy, fun, hot twist on. <laughs> only for you, only fans, friends. But again, we're here right now on YouTube. So uh, I should have my P.O. box by the end of this week. Uh, right now, they were out of P.O. boxes. <laughs> out of P.O. boxes. Woo! If I have to drive to the next town to get one, I will. It's fine. Um, I've just been doing my thing and enjoying life. A very, very simple life have I. <laughs> I, uh, and I'm, I'm loving that, and many of you know that too. Um, 
you know, listening to my records, and I, I really wanted to get this video out to you so that I could spend a little of Valentine's Day with you. And, um, yeah, just, just brightening my world. So I really don't have all that much else to share with you tonight, my darling YouTube friends. How about you put some in the comments? What do you want me to do for the next video? Oh, I'm sorry. Next video is at the indoor salt water bowl. I was there tonight. But um, I wanted to scope it out to see when there were the fewest people there. It turns out uh, either very early in the morning or between 8 and 10 at night are the best times for me to go there and do the, do the video in the pool for you, which will be a lot of fun. And that will be my next video. That is the plan anyways. So let me know. How are you? What are you doing to celebrate Valentine's Day? And, and worst case scenario, right? Be your own Valentine. What the heck, right? Buy yourself something pretty. <laughs> I remember my father used to say that to me whenever he'd go gambling. Another long story maybe I'll touch on one day, but he, he likes to gamble. And when he had a good night, he would throw, throw some chips at me and say, go buy yourself something pretty. <laughs> Valentine's Day and always a bright side. If you're alone, and I said that in so many videos, no matter what is going on, no matter how hard it is to find, even if it takes a few days to really see it, there is always a bright side. Even if the bright side doesn't compare to the downside, this it's still there. And it's our duty to ourselves to build upon that bright side. So if you're alone on Valentine's Day, which, by the way, I am. I'm alone on Valentine's Day, but I'm not really alone because I'm with you. And even though this video won't go on all day, I hope you carry it with you all day because I carry you with me all day. I do. And, uh, yeah, so I love you. I love you, my dear YouTube friends. And that's all for this evening's video, uh, which would be tomorrow morning's video, because as I said, I plan to hit post at midnight. Happy Valentine's Day. So much love, kisses, hugs, everything beautiful from me to you on this wonderful day. And on that note, I guess I'll call this a video. See you soon from the indoor saltwater heated pool here where I live in a bikini. Bye.